What is up everybody? I'm Brian and thank you for tuning in. Now today is March the 28th and this Saturday on April the 1st is the release of the Air Jordan 1 Royals. Now I want to try to pick that shoe up so I'm sure they're gonna do raffles or something but we're soon gonna find out. As I mentioned it is Tuesdays and most raffle um, only runs on Monday and Tuesday so I need to do it today or else I'm gonna miss out so I'm actually gonna hop on my cell phone real quick hit up some launch locators and see what stores are doing what to determine what I'm gonna uh, to determine what I'm gonna go do here in a few minutes so yeah let me open up my cell phone right now on my cell phone um, I usually look at Foot Locker and and Champs now I'm hoping they have something at the Lloyd Center because that is the nearest mall to where I live so I hit the release calendar and of course the shoes are releasing in April so on the top left up there you want to click the month change it to April and bam right there April 1st 2017 you can see the Jordan Retro 1 high and that's of course the uh, the the royal and right below it is the kid sizes so I want to click the men's and it shows the retail price is retailing for uh, roughly 160 but they're saying 159.99 same thing that's all the sizes right there and you want to click the launch locator now for this to work correctly you want to leave your location on so the app knows you know where the, the closest store to you is going to have it and it says right there price 160 limit one per customer so I want to click store and procedures and bam right there Lloyd Center is going to have it and up top it says sweepstakes right there now that means raffle so you want to you can click details it says right there tickets will be given out for the shoe you have selected on Monday March 27th and Tuesday March 28th limit one ticket per customer you must have valid photo ID to receive a ticket and they were announced the winner by phone on Wednesday or Thursday the 29th and the 30th so and if you do get your ticket drawn and they call you you have to go pick it up on release day April 1st looks like from when they open until 3 p.m. and you must have your ID with you along with the ticket so yeah there you go and I'm pretty sure if Champ or uh, Foot Locker has it at Lloyd then Champs will have it as well just to make sure open up the Champs Sports app right there and of course click the release calendar uh, change the, the top left there change it to April and bam yep just as I thought Retro Jordan 1 Royal click on that as well same thing click the launch locator and yeah limit one per customer and then you click store and procedure and right there Lloyd Center has them Clackamas Town Center has them Washington Square has them so of course I want to go to Lloyd I still click details and it said the same thing as I just mentioned and the thing with champs is I haven't actually done a raffle in a while it's probably been over a year or so but I remember champs cutting people off to do raffles at 5 p.m. that way it wouldn't you know they're, they're saying it wouldn't take away one of their employees from helping the customers just to do to do raffles so hopefully that changed because I mean I get off work around I get home around five six ish and you know I'm not gonna be at the mall before then so but yeah and and as it, it read on there it's, it's limit one per person um, I'm trying to gather up some people right now to go with me and answer for me for my size you can do that the only down side about that is if one of your family or friends uh, win the the raffle to come purchase the shoe then they have to go like let's say double D wins for my size and they call double D he has to go with me on Saturday I can't go there and pretend to be him or have his ID or whatever he has to go purchase the shoe with his ID of course I would then give him the money to buy it so yeah that's the only downside. It looks like Lloyd Center has Champs Foot Locker is doing a raffle, so we're going to head there now. Chic Shoes should be doing a raffle as well, but their raffle is a little bit different. I'll show you guys when we get to the mall, though. Anyways, let's go. All right, we're here at the Lloyd Center. Suit up Double D. All right, we're here at Champs in the Lloyd Center. Let's do it. Hopefully they don't ask me. <laughs> <laughs> 
Hold on, you, you. Take a picture of that. And of course, I knew it. To end it right before five. All right, since we took an L at Champs, swing over here to Foot Locker, see if they're doing a raffle. All right, we just took two L's. Apparently, Foot Locker and Champs shut off raffles at 6 p.m. So there's no way I'm gonna be make, to make any raffles in the future because I don't get, I, don't, I can't get to the mall in time on a Monday and Tuesday before 6 p.m. But well, looks like you have to call out the worker. <laughs> You're gonna be sick. Yeah, but. But yeah, we're gonna head over to Sheik. They have a cold system. They have a cold system. Usually, it's up front by the uh, the register. We'll check it out. <laughs> All right, it's a raffle code. Wait, I didn't know they were releasing the, the, the Cyber Mondays. <laughs> <laughs> this is a black and white photo. Of course, each store has a different code. But this is the one for the Lloyd Center. All right, hopefully Sheik saves us. It was our only raffle. Champs and Foot Locker, as I mentioned, closed their raffles at six. So Sheik has an online raffle that you can just do when you go home. So hopefully that saves us. While we're here, Mark's gonna look up some shoes. All right, that was kind of a fail. We couldn't even do the raffle at Champs or Foot Locker. They shut it down at 6 p.m. on Tuesdays. So, but it was pretty self-explanatory. You go there, you, um, you show them your ID and they write your, your size, your phone number, your name. Um, they keep one side of raffle ticket, give you the other side. And then you wait for a phone call, probably on Wednesday or Thursday. You wanna be on camera? You like the camera? Yeah. So yeah, we just I'm drowning my sorrows in a bunch of a bunch of food right now. <laughs> also this is closing. Yeah, I'm eating that. You know I'm gonna flip the camera. So yeah, drowning my sorrow in in some food right now from uh, Cajun Grill. I just subscribed. Double D eating there. I thought I had his old Life one. eating some stuff. Gaiden eating stuff. What you eating, Gaiden? Uh, oh, from Cajun Grill. Millie over there. Galen over there. <laughs> All right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and end the video. Got Double D here. Yep. My son got in here. I'm just gonna go ahead and end it here. Yeah, everybody's here. So yeah. Everybody um, likes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sorry I couldn't show you guys how it was done. Maybe on a future video we'll show it. But yeah, just gonna go ahead and end it. If you guys like the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Till my next video. See ya. See ya. <laughs> All right, we're here. Let's go inside and see what they got. Let's do it. All right, we we'll have the shoes. See what they got. No, this is a purse. Purse. <laughs> yeah. All right, looks like I found the men's kicks. Not a big selection. Yeah, guys, look at some of the kicks here. Yeah. Got my son in there in a cart, chilling.